Hi, uh, so let's come back and uh, we are at uh, 2 10 now, 2 o'clock, and uh, let's just compute the place uh, of this. And you know that uh, the strategy what we follow is uh, when we get all the prices before the market opens, both buy and sell calls, and then we start placing the orders once uh, it triggers. So, this is how uh, the trades are. I mean, TCS, Voltas, Karnataka Bank, HCL Dev, Bank of Baroda, SBI, many had done uh, final targets on the buy side. So let's just uh, check the charts and then uh, let's compute the, the profits. You can just see that uh, Adani Enterprises made uh, 795, and that was the peak. So we had a buy at uh, 785. So let me just get the intraday margins for this. So Adani Enterprises, uh, the intraday margin is 5,300. 5, so we have 10 rupees, 785 was the buy and uh, 795 was the target. So that gives us around 5000 rupees on uh, Adani Enterprises. ACC we had this buy again. Let me just close this down. So ACC buy about 1538. We did make uh, 1541 and uh, we are running this uh, short call. So let me just not let me just carry up for the next trade. Adani ports we had a buy. So you can see that it has already made uh, R1 and we have a sell call again. So you very small profits or modest profits. So our idea is uh, See what is the investment and uh, take the uh, maximum pro profit out of it. So 2700, sorry, Adani ports, 8700 is the investment for intraday. And uh, we have 350, 40, uh, 352, let's say 352, 40. So that's around 2 rupees on Adani uh, ports. So that will be 2000 rupees. Adani power also our cell call got activated. You can see that Adani power we had a short at 40.80. Now it is at 40.45. So that's roughly around 40 paise. So it was a 16. So around 1600 rupees on this. So your investment is 2700. You are making 1600 rupees. That's quite a good profit. Now, Athabad Bank had made, uh, we had a buy call, I'll just show you. Buy above 10220. It did uh, make 103. That is our target was this uh, brown line 103. So that, that will give us uh, 90 pesos in that. 90 pesos and we are running this uh, short call also, which uh, I am not adding now. So that's roughly around 80 pesos, let's say. That's another 1600 rupees on uh, Alhabad Bank. So investment is around 3100 and that's 50% return on your investment. Now let's come to the next trade. Amuja cement we had a buy call. I'll show you the buy price. 242 was the buy. So it made 244. 244.40. Let's say around 2400 rupees on Amuja cement. <laughs> So Andhra Bank again, uh, we had a call. We said uh, short below 7760. So that uh, did not happen. That is during the morning. Then we had this buy call. So our buy will be uh, the price above R1. Now we have the sell call which is continuing. 
So we will take this uh, current cell column which is running. So that will be our entry. So around 6, 65 say. That's around 2400 rupees in uh, Andhra Bank. Apollo tires are uh, short 180 to 90. So it did uh, come here and then uh, it again uh, rose up. So I'm not, I'm not uh, placing this. I'm in 283 short. Sorry, 238. So that again uh, did an S1 and then uh, we have this buy call. So let me just uh, show you what is a buy call uh, here. It did it R2, so 1.2. Around 1200 rupees. This Ashok Island we didn't place any uh, price. Asian paint uh, 779 was an uh, buy. So we have to open the chart. We have closed it. Arbindo Pharma 1354 was a sell. It did uh, go down. 1354 and you can see that uh, 1343 so roughly around 10 rupees on that so 2500 on uh, the access bank we had a buy at uh, 574 574 it did make uh, 577 so there is roughly 3 rupees on access bank so that is 1500 rupees and uh, you should remember that uh, the strategy behind this is looking at something like 10 to 20,000 rupees profit so you will have to come out with modest profits on each and every trade then only you will be able to make it otherwise there are chances like what we have been seeing today market goes up and then suddenly it fell uh, 40, 60, 40 points and again it's still going up so usually you'll get that kind of a trades but in case if you want to stick to the strategy you have to come out with some modest profits okay profits and come out of that trade bank of Baroda, we had a buy i'll show you the 15820 so 16020 that is two rupees though it went up i'm just taking this r1 that is the first target okay profits so that's two rupees profit. So that's 2500 on Bank of Baroda. Same thing with Bank of India, we had a buy call. 20760 was the entry. So that's roughly around one, one rupee up here, Bank of India. One rupee is thousand rupees. And just giving you an approximate figure it will usually be less than the profit that you have made it's actually if you just check it since i am uh, doing this for uh, so many calls i think i will have to try and finish fast there's a reason why i'm just uh, giving you an approximate figure so Bharti, uh, bharat forge you had this cell call that did not get triggered we had an uh, we placed in by 1248 which did not happen Bharti, Bharti Airtel, we had a short 393, it did uh, come down, it gave us some profit. 393. There is a sell call in BAMK Ardendi I81, there is a buy call in here, Moto for one. So we have uh, two calls. Let's continue with this, anyway, we are close with this. BHL 233 was a buy. So now it is 234. Uh, so let's say another uh, 235. 
So around 150 80 paise, around 1800 rupees on BHL. Let me just close this. So LBK, we have the short. Let it run. Ashok Leland did not have the number. Bank Nifty, anyway, we are not trading. So, BPCL, uh, we had a sell call uh, in the morning. It gave around 3 rupees. 777 was a sell. You can see that here. It made 3773. So, around roughly, let's say 3 rupees also. So, that's around 1500 rupees. Then we had a sell, we had a buy, uh, buy above here, 198.40, that was a gap up open, so ignore that, can bank we had a very good buy call, 356.70, we made 362, so we made 362, let's say 356. So that's roughly around 5300 rupees on CAN Bank. <laughs> Century Textiles, we had a short, it did not uh, trigger. 6740 was our uh, short, it did not trigger that. So again, we have this buy, uh, the buy price will be uh, buy above this price, that is 673. Coal India, we had a uh, 374 buy above, but uh, we got a sell call in the morning. Got a sell call and it made uh, some profit. And again, we have this buy call running, so well, roughly around say 1.4. So that's 1400 on uh, Coal India. So crop and Greaves, we had a buy again. You can just check that. And we had put it as uh, short below, that was before the market opened. And after the market opened, we got this buy call. So the sell did not get activated. So these are the profits 1.5. So DLF again we had a short 123.50. Uh, so let's take the current price 120 122.85. So roughly around uh, Roughly around 1 rupee, that will be around 2000. We have Dr. Reddy, we had a buy call, it did uh, go up. So we had this uh, Dr. Reddy buy at uh, 3639, now it is at 3646, let's say 3647. Thousand rupees on that. Federal Bank, we had a sell call. Sell below one thirty nine seventy. You can see that uh, it is still continuing. The target will be one thirty eight uh, fifty, one thirty eight sixty. So we will wait on that. Gail, we had a uh, buy about three ninety three. So that was a gap of open. 
95. Heavens, we had a shot to 68 then. So we had uh, random calls like this, that did not trigger. So it's still uh, 268 10 that should uh, trigger this price. HCL we had a buy above, but uh, we got a sell call. We got a sell call and then again it is a buy. Now it is at uh, 976. HDFC this uh, did not trigger. 1030 was a buy that did not trigger. CEC the buy did not trigger. We have a sell call running now. Can you see that? This is the entry, this is the current price, so around 5.7, so let's say 2500 rupees on that. So plus we didn't have a sell call, we actually had an uh, buy amount. Have it here, okay. So, no more call. We had a short buy above, sorry, buy above uh, 2619, but uh, at 920 we got a sell call. So, now uh, this is in profit. This buy call 2600 2601 is the buy, 2610 is the current price. Hindalco 139.80 that was a buy that we actually got a sell call at 920. So your buy call did not get activated. Uh, that did not trigger but in Petro we have uh, 615 sell that again did not trigger. IBRL it was a gap up open. Yeah, ICICI bank you can see that uh, this 313 31350 that did not trigger. Now we this particular cell call it got triggered. IDBA was another very good call on the buy side. IDBA and IDFC. IDBA I'll just give you the price. This was the price at which uh, we had to buy comfortably made uh, 70 paise. It's around 2800 on IDPI. IDFC we had a buy again. 155.20 made 157.40 uh, that's roughly 2 rupees of IDFC we have not included here IDFC idea we have the sun we had a short so idea was 170.40 is the short now it is at 168, uh, let's say 40. So that's roughly around 3 rupees down on IDM. There is a cell phone in SYN, the IDM A1. That will be around 6,000 rupees. So is Syndicate Bank, we have a cell. We had a buy in the morning. So that's CESE. So there India, is a cell phone in the ADAC OMM1. So Tata Farm, sorry, India, India Cement, uh, we had a um, short 89.70. Now it is at 88.89. Uh, 
That's what I'm starting to say on uh, India Cement. So that will be 400 rupees, 1400 rupees. So Infosys, uh, though the calls not triggered, this buy call did not trigger at 2051. And this sell call also it has not triggered. It has been uh, rather flat uh, from quite uh, three days. I will see, you can see that uh, we had a buy at uh, 350. Then we did uh, make 350.80, that is the first target. ITC, we had a good buy call. It came at around 9.20. It made its first target. There is a sell call in the 88 of W1. So that startup our sell. That's around 2 rupees 54 paise. Mm -hmm. 2500 and ITC. Mm -hmm. General still we had a buy that did trigger. 137 so it made uh, 140 uh, 140 so roughly around 3 rupees on this JSW steel this call did not trigger the buy call the buy price was 930.40 that did not trigger Jubilant food, we had a sell call. Karnataka Bank was one very good call. Uh, I'll just show you. So it made its R3. So 127.20 was the entry. So 133.20. This is a target that's roughly around 6 rupees. That's around 12,000 rupees uh, trade. So LIC was in finance. LNT was a very good call. I mean, uh, we had this buy at uh, 161641. Now it is at 1654. Twelve rupees. Twelve thirteen rupees. That's around sixteen hundred rupees uh, on for a Maruti, I just closed the trade. Sorry, I closed the chart. ONGC was a gap of open. We did put uh, a buy call at 319, but it was in uh, gap of open. So it's around uh, 322 now. So roughly around 3 rupees. Huh? We have petrol net that was an uh, we had with an uh, buy call uh, sorry uh, sell below at 183 but we got this buy at uh, 930 so this call did not get triggered pfc we had a buy about 276 so now it is at 279 
PNB was another uh, good call. Uh, basically, today the PSC banks were really good uh, to trade in the morning. We had all buy calls. So PNB we had a buy above, <coughs> sorry, 148.60. So it comfortably made its uh, target of R2. So that is 151.20. That's roughly around 3200 rupees. Next is power grid. We had a buy above and then, uh, sorry, we had the sell. I'll show you. So we did not place that. But we had this uh, buy and uh, sell call for power grid. So this was the sell price. It made that low. And again, we have this buy, which probably made around 1 rupee 20 pesi. So that's around 2400 rupees. PTC, we had a buy above 67.60. Sorry, first is sell below. And then uh, we have this uh, sell call now. So right below uh, your PP line, so that's around 50 by say down, that will be around 2000 rupees. It comes uh, Orcom, Orcom we had a short again, 64.30, now it is at 64, that's down by uh, A very small profit. It's roughly around 600 rupees. Next comes your uh, REC. A fantastic call. We had a buy about 306. Now it is at 310. So let's say uh, 4 rupees off. That's 4000 rupees. In cap, uh, we had a sell below initially that did not trigger. 401. And then we had this buy call which did not get triggered. You can see that. Now again, we had the sell call which is currently uh, in progress. So your sell is here. So roughly around 5.2. So let's say 2500 rupees on that. <coughs> so Reliance, we had this sum that did not trigger. I'll show you the price 894.50. That was the trigger that did not happen. And again, we had this buy which did not trigger. That was your buy price 905. 90520 Rel infra short at uh, 44170 It did make uh, S1 and then again we had this buy call and uh, we are currently running on the sell call now. So that's our power. 5410, it did make uh, 5420 uh, 10 paise. <coughs> and now we have the sell call. That's around roughly 28 paise on that. SBI, uh, we had a good call. Our uh, buy price was uh, 
288 that it opened uh, much above that you can see that here because the low today is 28940 and it made uh, 29596 Eighty nine forty. So it's around five rupees six thousand two fifty. So, this is we had a shot. 2030 it made 205 uh, <coughs> so sun pharma we had a buy at 984 so around more than 10 rupees 10 uh, 20 rupees on sun pharma we around 5000 rupees on Sun Pharma. Syndicate Bank, we had a buy 108.70. So we had that sell, and uh, at 9.20, we got this buy. The sell did not trigger. So I'm just taking the R2 level. So 1.1. So around 2000 rupees here. So Tata Com we had a buy, buy above 144, 140, uh, sorry, 442, 441, uh, 442 is a buy, so it made uh, 445. So around uh, 3 rupees on this Tata Com, that will be around 1500. Tata Com, we had a buy in the morning. Five thirteen seventeen. It comfortably we made it. So, Roughly around 1500 rupees on Tata Motors. Next one is Tata Power. We had a call uh, just now. We had a short 7570. It made uh, 7570. So that did not trigger, I guess. It did trigger 5 paise. Next is Tata Steel. We had a sell, but we got a buy call in Tata Steel in the morning. So that did not trigger. That sell call is continuing. Short buy land. TCS we had a uh, buy call. We said uh, sell below 255, 2554. Did make uh, some profit and again we had this buy call which was really good. So that's around 24 rupees up. Thousand rupees there at Mahindra. We have this buy above 
659. So roughly let's say 4 rupees up. 2000 rupees on Tech Mahindra. Union Bank we had a buy. So these are the morning calls 165.20, 167.20. So roughly around 2 rupees on Union Bank, that will be 2,000 rupees. UPL the call did not get me heard. So opened like this, Yama. Hold us as a good call. Uh, we had put it as a short, but we got a buy call. It was a gap up open. So our sell call did not get triggered. You can just uh, see what is the profit for told us that's around six rupees up. I am up to hold us here. Last will be uh, the S Bank. It said buy above 867. It did make uh, 870. So around 3 rupees. So let's say around 750 here. So these are the calls uh, that we had in the morning, and uh, we have some more calls which I'm not included. That is the sell calls uh, after in the afternoon session. Let's just try to uh, calculate what is the total uh, profit that we have made in these calls. So that's roughly around one lakh uh, thirteen thousand. So you can see that here. In, uh, sorry, I'm not show you. I'm just uh, summing it up in uh, Excel. So you can see that one lakh thirteen thousand here, roughly around forty three trades. On an average, uh, you have made around uh, two thousand six hundred rupees on each trade. So the idea is very simple. You should always look at what is your investment and try to make book your profits as soon as possible and come out of it. So ten ten or twenty thousand rupees. I am talking about uh, forty three trades now. But you don't need to do those many trades. Roughly around uh, 20 trades also would have given you very good uh, profits. So these are some of the trades that we have. And uh, we have used both uh, our trading tree and uh, our futures tree to uh, use this uh, particular strategy. So these are some of the calls. Now we have we have an, we had an SBI buy call which did all its profit. Now we have a sell call. Same thing with Bank of India. We had a buy call. Now we have a sell, which I have not included as profits now. So these are some of uh, the calls that we have currently running. That is Bank of India SBI sell. We have uh, Syndicate Bank sell and uh, some more calls. So this is how the strategy works. It works on any kind of market, and you see how uh, the market has actually uh, moved today. You can just see it uh, from the NSE. So that is how the market moved: 8420 to 8480, around 60 points in that range. We have these calls and uh, these kind of profits. So in case if you have any doubts, uh, you can just uh, call me or you can message me. So I was telling about this, there, are, there will be at least 10 or 20 trades. There will be some trades which will actually double your investment. That is, we have invested around 5,300 in uh, Adani Enterprises. We have made 5,000 here. And if you take the PSU banks, let's say uh, in this Karnataka bank, or uh, some trades like uh, the SBI, PNB, Syndicate Bank, Union Bank. These trades have actually uh, almost doubled uh, your investments, or more than 50% at least. 
so that is how you should be trading so let's say roughly around uh, 10000 rupees every day will uh, if you trade regularly you should be making around 2 lakh rupees every uh, month that is including the brokerage you know the brokerage will be uh, left at comfortable uh, profits so this is how the strategy works and in case if you have any doubts you can always uh, get in touch with me thanks bye